Hey up guys, Kunk the Hero here bringing you Soul Axiom. Now this was a brand like a, a believe it's a brand new game out on the Steam Marketplace and it looks really cool. I have played a little bit of it now, and the reason why I have to start again is because my computer decided to restart and to do updates and I didn't realise it and I did it halfway through the recording and just messed everything up. So I'm gonna start from the beginning again. It just means I'm gonna be able to go a little bit quicker now. I'll still show off all the different features because it is a beautiful game. So let's just jump straight into it. Okay, and we are in the game now. So, as you can see, it's got a beautiful graphic style to it. I really like it. But I have absolutely no idea what's going on in the game. Even though I have already played a bit of it, still got no idea what's going on in the game. But at least I'm going to be able to go a little bit quicker on some of this, because all you have to do for a lot of this is just after, uh, interact, so... Still very interesting about this. I believe it's to do about the afterlife and see the finding meaning in what was life. Oh god. So there we go. I have no idea what these are in walls, but you can interact with them and they'll say something. He moves in a mysterious way. His wonders to perform. He plants his footsteps in the sea and rides upon the storm. No idea what that means. But it looks cool. That's one thing that has to be said. It does look cool. So, gotta climb up this. I have no idea what that is above us. Okay. We're not going to escape, apparently. But, jump on this. I kind of want to see what this is going to do. Oh, God. Oh. Shit. And we crashed. Which is always great. But yeah, I do, I really like the styling of the game. It's really, it's partially minimalist, partially just really nice to look at. There aren't, there aren't many enemies, as you can see. I have no idea what that massive bird-like, maybe angel? Because it says afterlife after all, you imagine there might be an angel, but it's just, it's so, it's just secluded. It's nice. So we've got the last chance and gas. So yeah, nothing else for miles around. Let's see what's in here. Although that gas station does look pretty pretty empty. So what's in here? So you've got 
that up. Uh, yeah, uh, that's what you can do. You interact with the super horse apocalypse. But what I'm going to do first is have a little look around to see if I can find anything else, because I haven't had a proper look all the way around here yet. Let's see if I can get in here. Can I interact with this? Because that would be nice. Ah, oh, that's a shame. So I can't take the ladders. That one is gone. And that is Gravity Badges. Oh, that sounds awesome. Why can't I play that one? Oh, Stupid horses. Yes, uh, they've got loads of little signs, like, I still don't know what El, like, Alicia or Elsia is, don't have a clue, found another one of these though, there is nothing unpremeditated, nothing neglected by him, unsleeping, his unsleeping eye beholds all things, which is, that's a pretty weird thing to really say, but, sounds cool at least. So, get into the door, enter after this, well, that was different, and I don't know, I really have no idea what's happening with a lot of this, it's just, like nothing so, I said for this part has been really said about the story, it's just kind of follow one point. I hope they do elaborate properly in the story. And we have a portal. Nice. So Again, my memory is a bit hazy. I like the sign. Looks nice. Um, doo -doo -doo -doo. It's pretty desolate here. Ah, yes. Indiana Jones. Although, it actually walk goes really slowly. Then I, I think I just have to go down here. I think. Gotta give it. He's got legs like a boss. Jesus. And X-ray hand, which looks really weird. And so yeah, it has to be about a digital afterlife because otherwise, why is there so many computerized noises? Only reason it would make sense. I don't know if I want that. I really don't. So I'd like to. I would like to get rid of this object. Thank you. And that's first back in. So what does this one say? He has given you two hands, one to give, and the other to receive. Okay, that's nice. It's got to be said. It is a stunning game. Like, just looking at this, it looks so pretty. Just so nice. So, we need to... Oh, no, I need to phase it in. There we go. And... That matches up with this, so you have to phase in different parts to try and get it to match up and then you have to get rid of these so that the light can actually get there very it's such a nice concept though it's more of a puzzly game than anything but it's just nice to play really although the like physics on that bit just didn't really work you're standing on something moving. Is it gonna move? Nah, don't need to, mate. They can walk around. And that has gone down. There we go. Can this please move with me on it? Nope. 
how to bug out your game. Literally just stand on a moving platform and it won't move you at all. Yeah, such a pretty game. And we have another one of these balls, which goes in two. So nice. I still don't have a clue what Alicia, Elsia, whatever it is, means, but... Oh. Oh, that's a pretty moon. Okay, that isn't so pretty. That's nice. That's not. Let's just keep moving on. If I could just... It's just... It's very chilled. If you're having a bit of a stressful day, this is probably one of the games you should really play. Oh! Maybe it's le maybe that gives it leftover um, leftover material in one of them rocks, so it allows you to make up something else. That would make sense. Yeah, that would make sense. Oh. Why, thank you. Well, you followed me all along. I can't really ever feel that alone. Oh. I don't know where that went to. I can't even see if I'm about to fall off. This literally all I can see is blackness everywhere. The eyes are the windows to the soul. Why, thank you. Ah, that's what I didn't see. I need to go back that way now. I'm loving these little ramps though, thank you. Ah, what I did there, got this one. It's just so chilled. Oh, there it is. And there we go. Ooh, feeling very relaxed playing this. That doesn't normally happen. Don't know if I trust that. Oh, okay. I don't know what this does. Let's try and get rid of all that. I really don't have a clue what's happening right now, but that looks pretty cool. What does this do? Okay, well. We've got one bridge of electricity. All the way over there. Ooh, maybe that's what it's actually in reference to. Maybe if you have lights. So, is there another... If I can get rid of these. I have no idea what on earth is happening. And if you think this is dark on your screen, it's just as dark on this one as well. Honest to God, can't see a thing right now, but I don't want to turn it up in case we get to a really bright area of a level. Oh my God. I'd like to get rid of you. And get rid of you. What I might do is instead make that one. Oh, 
Okay, well, really, really got no idea what's happening right now. I kind of want to see what these little black holes are doing. Yep, yeah, that's about right. Can I do anything with that? Because it's just magic in there at the moment. Oh, uh, that's what I was wanting to do. Put it there. Like, genuinely, no idea what is happening with this. Maybe you have to do something with this? I have absolutely not a clue in anything. All I know is if I fall down there, I am going to die. There we go. That's doing something. So that's doing two things. That's interesting. Can I get this to work over here? Hmm. If I block this one. I don't see what is happening here. Can't even jump into the electricity. Maybe I have to get let's see what happens when I get rid of that. So if I get rid of this one and make this one there we go Th that took so long let's get rid of this one nice make that and we made the light bridge. Jesus, that took a while. I didn't get this far when I was had to play through. Okay. I don't know who the false prophet is, but okay. I feel like I'm slightly in Tron. Bloody hell. What is happening? Okay, so that's an angel. Um. Um. What? Um, what? <laughs> Let's keep going this way. Because this is a bit less crazy. I want to say a bit less crazy, just a bit. Okay. Oh, it's a little platform. I see.
I want I'm trying to make it there you go what's what's okay I was gonna say what's the issue now Ooh, it looks like a train I like trains if it wasn't already unpopular enough that there should have cinched it Jesus so yeah let's get on the train please oh, okay Well, this is... Oh. Okay. Welcome to Elysium. By now, you've already taken your first steps to immortality. By uploading your soul into the latest state-of-the-art soul provider, you're joining me and thousands of others in a sprawling server where memories and dreams become reality. I don't know about you, but there are some memories I'd rather forget, and hundreds I treasure the most. Elysia's Soul Sync system allows you to choose the memories you want to enjoy for eternity. You can relive your precious moments time and time again, and your loved ones can revisit them long after you're gone. Here in Elysia, death has no dominion. You're free to explore your memories to your heart's content, free of illness, any of your body's limitations. The monorail will be arriving at your soul station momentarily. Please mind your step as you leave the train and make your way to the nearest soul sync calibration unit. Elysia. Then, now, and forever. Okay, so thank you. That gave me some actual clarification on the story. That's pretty crazy, really. Oh, wow. I'd like to get off the train, please. Ooh, it's a little red ball. Thank you. I want to see what the red ball does, to be fair. I can't interact with that. Okay. Well, I actually think this is about a good time as I need to call it a quit to this episode. Really enjoyed this game. Really weird, but it's finally getting a bit more clarity to it so that we can see what's actually happening. So if you like this, please like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, I hope to, that you all watch the next episode as well. Because that will be coming up really soon. Uh, thank you again for watching. And have a great day. Bye.